to liana is a vine. The reality is that this vine grows from tree to tree in the African rainforest, and it ties together the trees in a community, in a net. It holds them together. The idea of the Anna song is that we use the aesthetic of song. So I teach songs, we learn songs, old songs, songs that were never written down. We all survive by the fact that we're connected, and music is what connects us. That is the concept of Liana song. My name is Sean Hennessy, Sean Patrick Hennessy. I was born in Northeast Philadelphia. I went to Emerson College, Berkeley School of Music. I went to Ghana, West Africa with Joe Gagliotta. I studied West African music there. I've been a musician for 13 years now. I live now in Northern Liberties, Philadelphia. Leona Song is, is a group, it's an ensemble. It's an ensemble of friends and family and artists of the dance world, of the drumming world, of the singing world. I have been given the role of the leader of the group. I just had to bring like the form that I had studied in Ghana, the styles, the different rhythms, the techniques. I had to teach them at first. It's becoming more and more of an equal part. Other people are speaking up and expressing themselves more and I can relax and let them come up with their own ideas and express themselves freely. You encounter many things when you, when you teach people who are the same age as you um, or even older than you. The way I look at it is every person has a different musical self. Everybody has been held back. Everybody has been pushed forward. So by the time you reach 20, 21, you're usually pretty messed up musically, like rhythmically. Like. We have to nurture that, these old songs. We have to nurture these old ways of, of communicating through music. And that's what we will hope, that's what we will, we will do with the Leona Song Foundation. That's what we are doing right now. I mean, it's, the school I teach mostly at is Germantown Friends School. I teach a lower school percussion ensemble, which is called the World Percussion Ensemble. We have another school that we're working with, which is Belmont Charter School. Belmont Charter School is, a, is, is out in West Philly on 40th and Brown, and, and they have a wonderful drill team already. So the kids got mad rhythm, and they have a lot of energy. What I like about drumming is that you get to express yourself in different ways. Teaching these young students is a miracle. It becomes, I'm playing with this kid. I'm playing with this person. We are on the same level. We're next to each other, like friends. So I'm playing with, the, with them, and I feel the rhythm. I feel the way that they interpret life. So what it has taught me is to appreciate young life. There's a place that you're leaving a space. Da, da, boom, ga, ga. Right there. Da, da, boom, ga, ga. When I'm first learning a beat, there's just one, there's like one part, like the bass drum is making it sort of hard for me, or the snare drum, or the hi-hat, that's just making it sort of hard for me. So I just look down at the um, instrument, and I just go, now, 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 like that. Being adept with rhythm at a younger age will help the child throughout their life, in whatever they do, and that is what the, I mean, that's what the Liana Song Foundation is about. The Newbridge Cultural Center will be located at Germantown and Jefferson and will be the home of Liana Song. This is going to be a performance space where Liana Song and Newbridge artists offer free classes and workshops to the community of North Philadelphia. Our work is a community effort led by a core of artists and educators. Uh, my partners are Brian Nadav, Brian Marcella, Eric Hickey, Abby Fat Martino, Jared Cohen. I'm Brian Nadav and I am one of the, the founding members of the New Bridge. The New Bridge provides this space in this urban environment where we are here not only to treat the problems of urban deterioration and urban blight, but we are redoing a building and it will be a cultural center and a space for all people to come and learn. For the most part, the people that are, are involved in